What is going on guys? So today I'm going to show you different ways to organize your Steam games in your Steam library. So basically I have to open up Steam first to even get here. So just make sure you have that open and then click on the library tab. Um, you may see different things here like I have this set to recent games. I'm going to go over what this is and then over here as well. So there's two ways we can organize our games. If we have, if you see all, that means you'll see all of your games, whether they're installed or not on the left hand side here. But if you cl click show only ready to play games, it removes all the ones that are not installed on your computer. And then there's another way if you just click that again, if you click show sort by recent activity, um, it organizes them in another way as well. You can also minimize these tabs. So if you only want to see your recent games, you can also just do this. For example, um, and then yeah, you can do that. You can also show tools, but that's not the point of this video. So I'm not going to do that. And then there's also a group by collection option selected. So that doesn't really do much for me, at least. Maybe if there's more games in your library, that might do something. But for me, that doesn't do anything. So that's different ways you can organize the games on the left hand side here. And in the middle, you'll see the option for add shelf. And what is this? That's basically what this thing is down here. So if I just add another one, we'll see that it looks pretty much the same. Once I just pick all, which shows all my games. Um, if I pick oh, all games, all is, I guess, shows tools as well. I'm not sure, but. All in all games, let's say it's the same thing. We can do favorites. I haven't favorited any of my games. We can do recent games. That's the one below here. Um, then we can do collections view, and then we can add games to a favorite. We can create a new collection. Um, and then yeah, play next as well. You can add games to this. So like if you right click, you can do add to new collection. Let's do. So if I do create collection here, um, it also shows it on the left hand side, which is cool, but um, I don't want to just show that. So let me, oh, that's what group by collection does. So now when I unselect that, because I had no collections created, it didn't work. So that makes sense. If I go back to home um, and then I do collections view. Now we can see my testing collection. I've added Dark Souls 3 to it. Um, and yeah, there's also now if you go library and you click collections, you can see the one you created as well. But I'll, cre I'll make another video about collections. This is more of just how to organize the games. So yeah, there's also play next. Um, and then there's soundtracks that you have. This is, I believe these three soundtracks that are not showing are from Elden Ring. But yeah, then you can just delete the shelf too. So that's pretty much it guys that's a bunch of ways to organize your games in steam not going to drag this video on for too long i'll make another video on collections so hopefully you found this helpful if you did drop a like don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching